Hey guys, welcome to the 14th of December. Welcome to another day of the Advent Calendar unboxing as I turn down this section of lights. And welcome to me doing the Advent Calendar one more time. So let's get into it, shall we? Straight into the Advent Calendar. Over the flap. We're now the reduced flap. Still don't need that yet. I'm not going to chuck it away. You never chuck anything away in an exit game. You never know when you might need it. I'll move the um, numbers out of the way. I'll move the hints out of the way. And I'll tear out the 14th of December, which is there. So, without further ado, let's read out the um, puzzle for today. Now, obviously, oh, you can immediately see letters down the side, and on the other side. But let's go, shall we? You quickly find the correct door in the corridor. Yeah, it's just in the rooms beyond. We're not the same level as the other rooms. You perhaps call this an attic or cellar. It's full of boxes that look rarely used. There are cobwebs hanging everywhere. You see an old cassette recorder that you switch on. Whilst listening to noisy Christmas music, you have an next clue. Make a Christmas garland as a decoration for me and my next clue for you. You don't actually have that much free time right now, but what must be, must be. I start making my garland with cassette stops. You turn it over, but this time new music plays. A deep voice reports, paper on the differences in the snow consistency in the Himalayas and the Alps. Chapter 1, Press Snow. What hell was this supposed to be? Couldn't really couldn't care less. You fast forward slightly. Feet and handprints in the snow are always the same stuff. This time we fast forward almost to the end. The human weight appears to contrast to my... This pseudoscience business does not encourage you to make the garland one bit. You turn the cassette over, you'd rather listen to a zipper than a version of Let It Snow again. Open door 14, find two cards in this one. Oh, we got more stuff there. I think I'm probably going to be cutting out later on in the um, series. We've got to one side, we're going to need that a bit in a bit. So let's have a look inside the room, shall we? We have... Not much to be honest. Just a box full of um, treasury stuff. And. Three points. We have another box. This sounds like a um, Little Mermaid, but it isn't, but we're really not much of a misfit tree at all. We got to Garland, it seems, at the top. With some baubles, one, two, three, four, five, six, and one on the floor. So I think without further ado, let's put that back down. Let's keep aiming that down. Uh, move the light away again. Without further ado, let's read days, day N, one and two. So I can put it there so you can read it there. Actually, you really can't, whatever, oh well. What it says. 
Firstly, get me angle right. Ammo on ammo, hold it tight. Start with top, and as you hold, alternate strands begin to fold. Check your folds are very neat, and we are cut of bubbles meet. Then start from the very top, read it loud until you stop. Let us make the word for out, the code you need to let you out. So. Arrow on arrow. Interesting, so let's... And coloured baubles are going to meet down the side there. You can't see it. You look down the side, see coloured baubles on the side of a paper bag, can you? Same on this one. So I'm going to quit out the uh, garlands. Cut out the Sid Garland. I'm actually going to turn off the um, inset. More random strands of paper for me to keep for some reason. It sounds like a Sukodan theme. I mean, it isn't, but it sounds like one. Firstly, get the arrow angle right. Arrow and arrow and hold it tight. Start at top as you hold. Alternate strands begin to fold. Check your folds are very neat and the coloured baubles meet. Yeah, green bubble beats green bubble. Yellow bubble on yellow. Purple on purple, I'll actually show you this. Purple bubble meets purple bubble. Green meets green. So I'm literally just following this up. And start from the very top, read aloud and two stop. So I'm just going to be doing this again. Make sure we put a bubbles meat. Hey, 
end. And start from the very top. Read aloud until you stop. O N E S E O N E Read around until you stop. It's a really bizarre thing to try and read. I'm not seeing a four. Can you see that there? F O U R. Ah, yes, I see it now. That reads F O U R. And you can't quite read it there. Z E R O and T W O. 402, I believe, is a code. It's very hard to get you to see that since it involves folding it in a very specific way. I believe it's 402. Let's try that, shall we? Four, zero, two. We're going that way, that way, that way. Hexagon plus moon. There we are. That there is day 15, all the way up there. Hey! I can jump back in there. Close the door. Move that out of the way. And I'll say thank you very much for watching today's Advent Calendar Fun. 
if you are still watching, well, I don't know if you are or not, but let me know in the comments what you think of today's puzzle, how I solved it, and um, what you think of the Advent Calendar so far. I mean, I'm really enjoying it. So thanks very much for watching. Join me again next time for some more from the Advent Calendar. So until then, have a wonderful day, and bye-bye.